Which brings us to our main event now, AJ Styles and Daniel Bryan taking on Rusev and Aiden English. We've got Daniel Bryan near the end of the match in the ring with Rusev. I think he hits him with the running knees, and then he turns around. AJ Styles is on the apron, and he gets low-blowed. So Shinsuke Nakamura, the king of strong style and the king of nutshots, is going crazy here. Hits AJ Styles with another one, and I love the camera close-up on Shinsuke's face. He's doing a great job as a heel. I mean, I think he's got a good look. He's sneaky. I love the interviews that he's doing and conducting with Renee Young. He did the one last week where he was just sarcastic as fuck. And he's like, no, speak of English. And then after this match, he's interviewed again by Renee Young and he does the same thing. So Shinsuke's work as a heel right now, much like Sami Zayn, has been a very, very pleasant surprise. And I think it's the best thing that they could have done with Shinsuke, and now it sets up a match with AJ in the future, and he could still win the WWE title. Wouldn't be surprised at all if that happens sooner rather than later. But after he nails AJ with that nut shot, Daniel Bryan sees all this happen, and then he's blindsided by Big Cass, who we saw earlier on approached him backstage. He attacks Daniel Bryan in the ring, beats the hell out of him, and I don't know if that's going to be a singles feud for Daniel Bryan. They're going to put Daniel Bryan in there with this giant right off the bat. I thought Daniel Bryan might work with The Miz. We'll find out what they're going to do with The Miz next week as he will be making his debut on SmackDown. I think he did a promo or a video at some point during SmackDown where he said he wants his own spotlight, so he's not going to be out there with all the other shakeup guys. He's going to wait till next week and make his appearance. So I don't know if this is just an initial debut for Big Cass and he just happened to attack Daniel Bryan or if it's going to lead to a match between the two or more tag team encounters or whatever but Big Cass rounds out all of the shakeups that took place on Smackdown Live and it's looking pretty good over there those weren't the only shakeups because throughout the course of Smackdown we got a few other announcements as well 